Well, look, kids. Haven't been on in a while. Been busy. But I found me a little gem. Bubba. Yep. I done found me a Bubba. A Bubba skisk. Found it on Craigslist. 350 bucks. Now I know I hear people saying, but you can't buy guns on Craigslist. You're right, you can't. But as long as you, uh, if you watch, keep an eye on it all the time. Man, I check it 40, 50 times a day. It just happened to pop up. I grabbed the guy's number. Within 10 minutes, the ad was pulled. But got the guy's number, called him, said, have you still got it? Yeah. Well, I'm not excited about the bubblegum shrimp boat. But got a couple of these uh, janky 20 round tap goes. But when I went over to take a look at the thing, you know, I get a good close look on it, and uh, I really wish they wouldn't have stamped it like that. But sorry, I have no macro on this camera, but it uh, it's an actual Russian, believe it or not. And it's unmolested. It's obviously been fact or it's been rearsenaled. It's black. It's painted. There's a rearsenal mark on the top. Um see what else. Yeah, so it's it's obviously it's been painted. I don't have a number anywhere on the thing as far as date, so I'm guessing it's a 56. I don't know. But uh there's no date code on it stamped anywhere. But it's unmolested. Everything's clean. There's nothing jacked on it. I mean, some of this shit here is pretty fucked, but all that's coming off. But when I was standing there talking to the guy, he goes, Well, I got that ugly ass brown shit that came on it if you want it. He said, Oh, you mean the original stock? Sure. Again, Ben re arsenal a couple, couple of different stamps there, but so I'm like, cool, I'll take that. Not the prettiest color in the world, but been painted, obviously, but but for the price, I couldn't beat it, so I snagged it up, and uh, I fired it quite a bit, shot a couple hundred rounds through it. It's pretty decent. There's my target, 100 feet rapid fire, just as fast as I can pull the trigger. Not too bad, I guess. For an old surplus rifle, but everything seems to work on it. It's got an AK strap. The bale's been polished. I'm assuming it's been, it was done at the, uh, at the arsenal. Because the redneck hillbilly kid that I got it from, he's like, I was going to sharpen it, put an edge on it, but... I'm like, well, gee, I'm glad you didn't. <laughs> but, so anyhow, I mean, it, uh, this was all black when I got it. Um, he yanked it off, cleaned it, shined it, buffed it up on my buffing wheel. And, uh, everything turned out nice. There's another sign that it's been re-arsenal. Nice and brand new. But, uh. Anyway, I hope to get some vids of this thing put back together in a proper wooden stock. It's like, you know, when you buy these black plastic Tapco kit, just go buy a fucking AK. But, anyway, I got lucky grabbing this thing up, you know, with the whole Obama speech and abuse of power and Reckless abandonment and everything else about his dumbass. I got lucky to find the thing when I did. I got a couple hundred rounds of ammo. Didn't come with it, but I uh, I bought a couple hundred rounds. But uh, right after I snagged this up, it wasn't shit a week, and everything just the prices just went through the roof. I mean, I went from being able to buy a 
hundred or a thousand round case of ammo for two hundred and fifty bucks shipped, and now it's four hundred, five hundred. Some of those scumbags like uh, Alamo Ammo, I love their their little slogan. Need bullets? We'll shoot them out to you. Nobody buys bullets, puke. But uh, <laughs> anyway, those sons of bitches are charging thirteen bucks for a twenty round box of Tula, or uh, was it Tula or Wolf? I don't know. Either or, same difference. But it's like thirteen bucks. Goddamn. I can buy a Chinese steel core rounds that have been illegal since the 90s for 12 bucks a box. And those are actually kind of fun to shoot. <laughs> but, anyway. I'm going to put Bubba Gump back the way he's supposed to be. And, uh, I don't know. You guys got any ideas or suggestions or anything you want to say? Spit it out. Boy, she sure is an oily bitch. I loves my oils, but cool thing is I have a new stock to play with. Now I just have to figure out a a proper color. Thinking a dark red. But if you guys have any suggestions or anything or ideas, whatever, let me know. Oh yeah, gotta show the nice uh, fluorescent orange sight, which actually is kind of nice. The uh, I know the black sight on my. On my other SKS is almost impossible to see. But well if you guys have any ideas or thoughts or anything, shoot me a, a a message. But I know nobody watches my videos, but I don't really care. But Alright, well haven't talked to you guys in a while. Hope you enjoyed. And if you didn't, hey, tough fuck you. You didn't pay anything for this. <laughs> so um I guess if you don't like it, just Send me a request for your money back. How's that? Yeah, found my files. I've been looking for those. Alrighty, kids. Well, as I used to say, kiss my ass. <laughs>